Yo, what is going on, people? Welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to be teaching you text view. Now you might be thinking, what is text view? Well, text view is actually how you open up PA images. Now you can also save images, BMP, TIFF, PNG, all these type of file formats that you do want to do. Sometimes as well, you may open up images and the picture might actually be invisible, but there actually is an image there, so don't worry about that. Make sure to go ahead and follow my Twitch. I hope you get to 200 followers. Leave a subscription and a like. And join my Discord if you need any help. I'll see you in a minute. The first thing that you guys want to do is you want to head over to Steam. Now in Steam, this is the new update. Most of you will probably have this. Go to games and as you can see, there is a selection for tools. So tick that button there and as you can see, you'll have twice as many game things as you already had before. As you can see, I've already got Daisy tools installed. There should be a button here saying install, but I can launch this as I've already got it installed. Now, text view. I want you guys to click on text view and up here is, is file. This is what you're going to be going to a lot in text view. But as you can see, this is what it looks like. Now you scroll wheel to zoom into pictures and to zoom out. But if you want to open up a PAA, go to file, open and find where the actual place of your image is. So mine is in my P drive. I'm going to double click this PN PAA. And as you can see, now I can see the texture. Scroll wheel to zoom in and out. And it tells you the file size underneath. So that's pretty handy if you have a big image. Or you need to know really quickly how big the actual image is. Now to actually save an image as a PNG. So maybe you've got a PAA. And you don't want it to be a PAA anymore. What you can do is you can type NG at the end of it. Save. If you've already got that you can replace it by clicking yes. Now it's the same way if you want to save an image as a PAA, literally when it says PNG, put two A's on the end, save it and now you'll have a new image. Now some of you guys might be saying, well how do I actually open up an invisible image as you said in the intro? Well, if you go to your folder and find out your P drive or any of your invisible images, in DayZ, surfaces and in data, terrain, in here, you can see many images, all these different things, and they actually are all invisible. Now, to sort this out, simply what you need to do is change this RGBA into RGB. And as you can see, this is a Daisy texture. You guys have probably seen it while you've been roaming around Janaris. You can save this file, save as NG if you also want to. But this has been how to view some invisible images and view images. PAA. Thank you guys for watching this video. I really do appreciate it. Make sure to leave a like and a subscription and I'll see you guys next time. Adios amigos.